Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay tuned. We'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man, Stuart Robson. And today it's the opening game in this particular group at the Euros. It's Portugal, and they take on Czechia. Well, it's vital that you don't have an off day in these group games. Consistency is key to progressing further in the tournament. I'm looking forward to a hard-fought contest here today, Derek. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Well, it's a flat 4-5-1, which would suggest they're going to try and play on the counter-attack. However, that will only work if they don't drop too deep and can't support the main striker. And the starting 11 for Czechia. Well, on paper, it looks a fairly cautious approach because unless their wing backs can get into more advanced areas, I'm not sure where the attacking width will come from. And the contest begins. Joao Cancelo. Cancelo. And Cristiano Ronaldo waiting. Half-hearted clearance. And a chance to whip it in here. Bruno Fernandes. And a goal it is. No long wait for the opener today. Well, here it is, 1v1 against the keeper, and the outcome was never really in doubt. He never looked like missing that. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Well, a really good run. And he's made headway. They just couldn't stay in front. And now this match is all square. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. Joao Felix.
Bruno Fernandes has it. On to Silva. Palinha. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And unfortunately for him, he had worked his way into an offside position. And I think everybody in the ground could see that was always going to be offside. And Patrick Schick now. Can he take the chance? And there is the goal! He's found the net. Joy unconfined. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb, but you do have to ask questions of the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't be beaten at your near post like that. And Portugal get the game restarted. Disappointed to have conceded. Now can they come up with a quick response? And a good tackle. Ronaldo! And it goes to square the game! What a contest this is turning out to be! Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. So, back underway. The game having been squared at 2-2. And the referee blows the whistle. It is a free kick. A deft clearance. Cristiano Ronaldo. And Palinha with it. Rafael Leao. Bruno Fernandes has it. Let's fly here and fire against the crossbar. And the danger clear. And Portugal moving the ball with purpose. Well, they're certainly getting closer. You just sense that the goal is coming. They're playing so well at the moment. A chance to nudge in front. Corner kick here. Oh, my goodness. You've really got to praise the defending. That was top notch. Well, behind for another corner. Fine goalkeeping. So the corner played into the box. No nonsense clearance. And increasing the pressure. Another corner it is. Oh, an incredible clearance. I must say, I didn't see that coming. Jurasek, chance maybe to use their counter-attacking ability to good effect. Well, it broke down, alas. Joao Felix, he's in position. And a goal! In the lead again, fully deserved! Just watch this again. Zhao Felix's pass is inch perfect, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Thank <laughs> you. 
Well, back underway, and a glut of goals here. 3 2. Klojek. This is looking threatening. It's a perfect challenge. Oh, no! Not a moment the keeper will want to revisit. Well, he's got to pick himself up now. Well, as the replay shows us, that will be classed as an own goal. He's a bit unlucky there. Underway again. We can't complain about a lack of entertainment. 3-3. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, it was a magical first half performance from Cristiano Ronaldo. No doubt about that, Stuart. Well, I really liked his first half display. He was certainly the most influential player on the field. And I'm expecting more of the same in the second 45 minutes. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. They're racing away here. But he was on his toes to win the ball back. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, just look at how poor the defending is here. But I have to say, it's still a very tidy finish. He looked really assured there. Well, how about this? 4-3. Tomasz Socek. Tomasz Holesz. Lukas Probod. Barak has it. Well read to ease the pressure. Can't miss, surely. This corner could be useful to them. They favoured a short one here. That is how to apply the pressure. Joao Felix. Here's Ronaldo. Fernandes. Patient enough build-up. Can they carve out a chance? And it's opening up. Oh, did so well to deny him. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Who can he pick out? Well, the danger is still there. Bruno Fernandes has it. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Vladimir Tsofal. Can they hit on the break? Made it look routine, but read it well. Well, it could be on for him here. No shortage of excitement. Level again. No wonder they're excited. 
Well, here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Well, you don't get too many score lines like this one. 4-4. Four, four. Joao Felix. And Palinha with it. Joao Cancelo. On the ball, Joao Felix. Rafael Leao. Delightful pass. And the keeper really reacted brilliantly. Well, from that sort of range, it's a great save, I have to say. And a substitution in the offing. He's driven in the corner. Half-hearted clearance. Bruno Fernandes. And thumped away. Pepe. And Palinha with it. Big chance. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Still pushing for what could be a winner. Cutting the ball back. Still could be dangerous. Can he find the net? The cross is on. Tremendous defending to stonewall him. Rafael Leao. And he might be through here. Oh, can you believe it? With so little time left, surely that will be the winner. Amazing scenes here. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. I'd have to go back quite a few years to remember the last time I covered a game with a scoreline of 5-4. And the referee says that will do it. It is a win for Portugal, just what they were hoping for. Stuart, your overall assessment. Yes, Derek. Well, it could have gone either way, couldn't it? It's so competitive for much of the game, but they kept pushing, kept believing, and probably deserved the winner in the end. A great result. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat. And he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display that was.